Hello, hello, hello. If you are watching, say hi. Hi. I'm Prophet Moses. I am in the house of God. Someone asked me, no, Prophet Moses, what is coronavirus? What is coronavirus? Then I said, no. I don't know. Only God knows. God bless you all, you are. God bless you. God bless you. Yeah, the children of the living God, I just want to say hi. And I want to encourage you something. There is a, there is an Ella somewhere. But I want just to encourage you. I want just to talk about fear. When I was praying to the mountain, about coronavirus. God, he showed me the star, the star of revelation. Then he said, no, I want to change the weather. But I love you, Zambia. God, he loves Zambia. Zambian, say hi to your neighbors. When I was after prayer, after prayer, after prayer of the mountain, mountain of prayer, I saw something. Evil. In Zambia. God, he showed me something. He revealed me something in this nation. But uh, the spirit of the living God was spoken, was spoken to me to say, no, tell Zambia to have no fear. Tell Zambia to have no fear. Tell Zambia to stand in fame. To pray against this small disease. This is small disease. But I want you to know this. Yeah, in the scripture of Isaiah, Isaiah chapter 41, verse 10, the Bible says, We should have no fear. The Bible says, I've given you the spirit not to have fear. And as a Christian, must have no fear. You are a Christian. You are a Christian. You are in the Christian nation. You must have no fear. Tell your neighbor, have no fear. Tell your wife, have no fear. Tell your leaders, have no fear. When you are in Christ, we are the conquerors. When we are in Christ, we are the winners. We have the winning source. But I want you to know this, the Zambians. Don't allow the spirit of fear to enter you. For the Bible, Jesus was, Jesus, he said to his disciples, no, I've given you peace, not to be afraid of anything. I've given you the power and the authority. Zambians, we have power and the authority. 
to stand, to pray against this coronavirus, COVID-19. <laughs> Hallelujah. When you allow the spirit of fear to enter you, you are finished. And don't allow devil, don't let him to brought you the spirit of fear. Because once the fear, if the fear has entered you, you are finished, my dear. You are finished, you are finished. You know, the Bible says that the world is covered with the wickedness. It's covered with the wickedness. This is wickedness. Coronavirus. This is the wickedness. This is the wickedness. will survive by the grace of God, will survive by His mighty power. Tell your neighbor that I will survive with His mighty power. Now listen, I want you to know this. You have not, you have not born to die by premature death caused by corona. You have not Born to die with the premature death. You are a daughter, you are a son of victory. Hello? You are the daughter of victory, you are a son of victory. You must have no fear. Hello? The Bible says that we must have no fear. Courage, your, courage your, your neighbor, neighbor. Wake up. Let's play it against this coronavirus. So the Bible says in the scripture of Psalm that pray to against every evil manipulation. Because devil is a loser. Now, I want you to know this. You have given chance to a, to a devil. The Bible says that a devil is coming to steal, to kill and destroy. So I want you to know this. Because of coronavirus, people will stop greeting each other. We stop a handshake. Devil has brought us the greeting style from under worship. Hmm? Let's wake up. Wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Devil is coming to kill, to destroy, and to steal. Devil is sending the coronavirus to come and steal the love. Because the Bible said that greet using and shake one another, which is a sign of love. And then devil he came and he steal that love of and shake. <laughs> Hello? And now we need the restoration of love. It's still peace. He has killed peace. He has killed love because of coronavirus. People, we need restoration. We need restoration. And I want you to know this, that the power, Idiamaka, that power, Jesus said that no, I've given you the power and the authority. That 
that was not the power. That was not the power to have fear. That is the power to stand in his spirit and in his truth. Let's like be the stone. We must not shake it off. Hello. God loves Zambia. God is he loves Zambia so much. He loves Zambia so much. Because Zambia is a Christian nation. And for that peace, for that love, for that unity, for that work, for that I don't know what I can say. That peace what they was killed, we need to pray that God restore us. And that love which God has which they was still, we need to pray. We must pray that God should restore us. Let's be like a shadow like Meshach and Abednego. They refuse to worship the idols. And then by this time, some of the people, they are worshipping the coronavirus. Hey, you, have no fear. Okay? This is not the time to have fear. This is not the time to have no fear. This is the time to have no fear. This is not the time to have fear. Hello? Fear can cause you premature death. Fear can cause you poverty. Fear can cause you suffering, crying day and night. Zambia, let's wake up. Let's wake up. The devil has brought us the demon of coronavirus. The demon of coronavirus. As you can see, but wake up. Wake up. Because he wants to close all eyes so that we may not see what is happening in Zambia. The Bible says in the book of uh, Matthew 10, the stain, devil is coming to still destroy and kill, but Jesus is coming to give us life. Jesus is coming for you and I. And you, you bring us the restoration. And I thank you for the Minister of Health. I thank you very much. I thanks. I thank you very much, Minister of Health. I thank you and God bless you. I want to pray for you. Right now. With my open eyes. I want to pray for you, Zambia. And the ministry of health. God bless you. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Jehovah God, Jehovah Shama, Jehovah Shalom. My Father Jesus Christ, I pray, Almighty God, 